So a week ago, I posted a video and um, it was a celebration for hitting 1000 subscribers and it was a free giveaway. And now it is the time to pick that person right now from a random comment picker. I already have the link in here. Everything's all set. If you put a comment after this video or time of recording anyway, it doesn't count. Too late, you had a whole week. Also, uh, a lot less, well, obviously the deck profile was gonna get more <laughs> than that video, but surprising a lot less um, views on that one versus the Andrew's deck profile, which I was like, well, I don't feel like anybody should watch that one. I, get, I went to 6-3, come on now. Uh, anyway, uh, it's, and it's free stuff, anyway. Anyway, so let me go ahead, build up suspense, play the music, and this is the person who won, and this, by the way, is for a winner, Matt. The three packs. And for free. And if you haven't already, go sign up for the uh, untapped <laughs> tournament and tell your friends. Share the link. Join the thing. You can join. By the way, you can join. <laughs> I know. I'm, I <laughs> it's suspenseful. Uh, you can join via the Talange link, sign up, reserve your spot. And then I think on Saturday, I've decided to, to take... Uh, everybody's entry fee and as well as their deck list at that point and close it out so that way on Sunday we're not doing last minute BS um, and we can go from there now back to the random winner and that winner is Kenpachi Uchiha more matches from Untap okay that's cool with me man now, uh, if you see your name and if you know who you are, which I hope so, <laughs> join the Discord, um, send me a private message, let me know like, hey, this is me. You can screenshot your, your whole name or whatever, or give me proof or whatever, I don't know. But please go ahead and uh, reach out to me on Discord uh, for your address and I'll go ahead and send it out to you um, and we'll, we'll go ahead and verify through that. So congratulations. Mr. Kinpachi, I'm just gonna click on your your channel. Um, <laughs> okay, okay, cool, awesome, awesome. A lot of uh, random stuff. Now you're on the channel. Congratulations. Uh, and now, <laughs> what I actually wanted to do to um, actually answer pretty much everybody who's who's um, or at least give give like a response to everybody uh, in the in the comments as well. I'm gonna go ahead and go through them really quick um, and just give my feedback as far as that goes and what my plans are. Uh, for that. Also, I will say that if we look up, uh, yeah, deck profile, there are nine ma there are ten matches or mentioning for that, various ones as far as that goes. I understand that. Uh, budget, there is six six matches for that as well. Uh, and I think uh, what was the other one? Uh, openings. Uh, there was some for that, and there's four matches for that, and then a couple other ones. But going through the list, if we take a look at here. Uh, keep up the food wor food work. I will. I definitely will. I hey, listen. Food work is all all about it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, Mika, is that how you say your name? Uh, I don't think you mentioned anything about the video mat. Yeah, I totally, I, do I totally went off on a tangent on something else. I was also salty about round two. Uh, I replied to the replied to the comment, but for anybody who went to the Corchi CG LA Regional, uh, wow, that was really official of me. Um, they uh they, they did have long breaks the, the double sleeping rule is silly I, I talked all about it the side event, event vegeta mats it was all very annoying yes uh i think what happened for me is that after the first round i found out about the side event and the vegeta mat and i went to go check and they were like oh we only had 80 available and i was like you have 80 mats available throughout the whole day for 480 people are you kidding me man and I was just mad. I was just like, whatever. People were buying them out, and some people were buying. Uh, they had a whole deal of like, uh, like a booster set, and then like the pay ma play mat, and then whatever else for like 120 bucks. And people were buying that out left and right. And I was like, well, I guess, I guess that's fine. Plus, I didn't have any, um, I didn't have any cash, so I was like, well, that's dope, fam. Uh, I like the meta explanations. Plus, they were really helpful for building my deck. In LA Regional, hey, let me know how you how you uh, how you did in that one. I never did reply to that one, so sorry about that. Um, and thank you for the congratulations. 
Um, I will definitely be talking more through meta um, explanations or breakdowns or whatever changes. Uh, the meta staples is definitely one of the directions I want to take this channel in um, as far as just having value and reference to. And uh, of course, the more that I make, I can always reference uh, time by time, like one month to another and see how different it is. Uh, Cause I think that's always interesting too. Plus I do want to um, experiment more with the meta leaders, but I've said it before uh, that like the winning engines and decks right now are pretty much the same. And there, there's a big problem with uh, net decking and as well as people taking top decks, whether it's like top four or whatever, um, and, and just playing those and adding their like little one or two card spice, you know? And I, I think that's a problem. I think that's typical in a meta. I think that's expected in a meta. Uh, however, the thing is, is that, you, you know, the, the St. Louis one just came out uh, as far as the um the results and and everything else like that it was small it was much smaller than la right but there there were the blue yellow hurigans there were the vegeta lock ones but what took it was super saiyan 3 uh, blue yellow and right before that was uh mono blue and right before that was android so my thing is that the meta will always be local slash depending on what you're going to the timing and location and all that and the other part of it is that you define the meta like you you as a person as a player have an ability to um play and develop and, and and do different things uh in order to get to that top 10 or top four or first place and from that point people can build on onto it that's fine but in order to get creative and everything else like that you gotta start you gotta start rocking the ship yourself ah, anyway that's that's a whole tangent Crash of 1k thank you sergeant rex power core storm again that's a name right there. I would like to see more openings. Yeah, I definitely need to do some more openings. Um, uh, I, I know some deals here and there, and I'm sure I can hook, I, my local shops can hook it up as well. But in general, I think uh, more openings, maybe like once a week would be pretty cool. Uh, I might do that. Uh, it's just that uh, I like I like the fact that like obviously not every single video has that, but I like having videos that you can reference to or share or gain value from in a, in a in a good way and learn from i think openings is good on the gotcha slash like um just uh getting more packs and stuff like that just like wondering what it is that's that's a cool factor that's one of the best parts of a card game but at the same time on a video aspect i don't really like doing it because um you don't really get anything out of it other than just seeing me get more cards <laughs> but yeah definitely i will i will do that more often uh for more friday night play videos i definitely took that to heart so i uh, the last few videos were about untap uh we did uh friday night fights that was like so much fun uh if you haven't been tuning in for that definitely um check out it's most likely gonna be every other week um at least um, we, we might do one this friday it just depends on everybody's schedule it depends on mine and what i'm doing on that day um, but most of the time that's it's always gonna be cool uh, and also loving the thoughts process during play Yeah, definitely uh, sometimes we just fuck around but other times we do explain what's going on more deck profiles and more battles Yeah, thank you birthday card. Uh, we will I, I will be doing that I got some deck profiles this, this week upcoming So watch out for those more ways to combat the minute I did want to do like the thing about that is that people are always so contrarian about contrarian about like um combating combating the meta or whatever uh i think it really depends on your play style it depends on what uh tech you have in your in your deck and uh just overall i think it's good to to show how to combat something so like if we had to talk through uh storm right if we were to our formula known as storm shout out to manny combs <laughs> i if, if you're watching this like i i like saying maddie combs like maddie combs sounds cool uh <laughs> matthew combs 3xg projection so uh, for me, no, as one two or a storm one two swap. So if you're talking about how to com combat that, I think the best way to do that right now, just as a short version, is androids, which is why I took it. Co uh, speedy surprise attack and surviving the first few rounds in order to a cell chain really shuts down their their hand. I had no problem so far anyway with blue yellow anything because of that. The only time that I had had a problem was uh, Vegeta lock and they locked me down to two energy. Most of my plays are three or more, so. You get the idea. Other way, other ways is peel off. You did see that tech, or if you didn't see it in um, St. Louis, that's really good. To uh, if they they're swinging with uh, Bardock or something else, you can take away uh, their swap in order to to combat that. So peel off is kind of a a, a good secret tech there. Um, 
And a couple other ways, you know, Sensu being uh, making sure to time your counters right. So if they're all tapped out and they only have one one attacker left, go ahead and counter that. That'll buy your turn pretty much every single time. The only only um, the only concern about that is overwhelm. Anyway, I'm gonna take. A, I'm gonna do a whole video on that. Most likely, I don't know yet. I'm gonna get some more references, but also I want to see how the meta develops and see what other answers are, are coming around to. Christopher Borg says, "Congrats, man! Love the videos. Thank you. I appreciate that. I I hope my decks are fun, and also you can beat people with it." Edgar says, "More deck profiles. I agree. And a couple of matches showing off the decks. I tried that, um, so I'm gonna keep trying that in the Jiren, Jiren profile or Jiren deck. So check that out." Novo says, congrats, thank you. Uh, I will learn toot, but toot video contents. Okay, cool. <laughs> what I like is more meta analysis. Yep, I understand. Said it earlier. And then more matches, matches from Untap. My, our winner here, my man, the winner. Um, wish me call it. Uh, yeah, 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 definitely. Definitely more, more matches from Untap. If you have, again, tourney, matches tourney. I'm going to get some more people. Um, and recorded and everything else like that. So check out those. Awesome job. Thank you. More matchup and a meta analysis. Uh, well, thank you. I appreciate that. I'll definitely get some more of that. Thank you, Nick. And then more deck profiles, more fun deck profiles. That's all what I'm all about. Meta, -re meta, -re meta relevant decks. And I love the Discord channel. Well, hey, uh, shout out yourself on the Discord channel. Um, I, I don't know who you are on this one. I probably do, but I don't. <laughs> Friday Night Fights. You already know. Uh, where your tournament will be held online on untap.in. So just like untap.com, it is untap.in. And uh, all the information is in the previous video from yesterday. So check that out. My man, Dakota. Uh, more meta analysis. I get that. Uh, nice going 6-3. I appreciate that. Uh, good luck in September. So that's it. <laughs> Good luck, Adrian. Uh, congrats on that. I've uh, been loving your take on, on decks and battle series. Been fun to watch. I appreciate that. Um, even though you didn't top of the original, I would like to see it. That's why I put it out there. So there you go, Jake. Go. Uh, hated the end time ruling. You and I both, my friend. Um, more deck profile, untapped, uh, budget deck options, do's, don't videos, tips and strategies. So overall, basically all the things that have been mentioned and trying to do. So definitely K12BN. I will do that. Uh, Tristan Johnson, I, I read it as Tristan Thompson. I was like, you guy, uh, I want to be in it. I don't know what that means, but um, maybe some cryptic message in which I'm like, you know, just, you know, I want to be in it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> All right, anyway, more of your soothing voice. I don't really see that, but I, hey, thank you, Hyper Knuckles. Um, I think it would be cool to play with your subscribers uh, and maybe do more clips on the inside when it can be proved on Untap. Uh, yeah, I mean, if you're uh, joining Discord, right? Uh, and we're, it's, there's no like Patreon or whatever BS, you know, this just <laughs> might literally is just a community. Uh, more and more people talking, more and more people giving out deck profiles and thoughts and theories and stuff like that. That's what I want to see. Definitely check that out. And then on Friday Night Fights, I'm more than happy to play anybody. Um, you know, I, I play Joel only because he and I just go at it at times. So that's that's it. <laughs> um, uh, would like to see more collab videos with Supa and Mafuba and such. Well, hey, I'm more than happy to, to collab and talk through and make videos. That was, that was the whole thing for me, too. I just, I really wanted to do that for the untapped battle series. Uh, it just kind of fell through for me because I haven't been following up on that. So if people are watching who you have, you are a content creator, uh, if you're a person like super players, even though I, I t again, I tried to talk to one of them, they just didn't seem interested in talking. And I'm like, okay, bye. <laughs> and then the Mafuba, Mafuba Jar, I'm sure they're, they're cool people. I just haven't really reached out to them. Uh, congrats, do more track profiles. All right, I'll try. Um, more boys on stream night, my boy. You already know. You already know. If you're there, you're there. Uh, untap a tournament. I'm down. Do more openings. Okay. Cool. More shenanigans. You already know. Uh, I do need to do a shenanigans video, one or two of them. So that's on the list. Uh, congrats. Thank you. Dominic says, maybe a new category where you create a deck to counter something. Oh, yeah. I mean, you know, I could do that. Uh, it's just a little bit hard, but I, I will do that. Plus, it is one of those things of like, if I'm going to go into a regional or locals or whatever, do I want to release that and counter that? Counter the counter. <laughs> and I'm doing a mirror match all day. Um, a tutorial is where you teach uh, a series in which the mechanics lack the cards and this and that. 
Okay, I can see that. Canyon Bar says you'd be cool to upload a videos and deck, deck your profile. Uh, again, Untapped Battle Series and the Friday Night Fights is where we're going to be doing that. Uh, more meta discussions and cards of interest and potential an answers to cards. Meta staples and other things like that will be it. It's Richie! More DBS card gameplay. Again, Untapped Battle Series and Friday Night Fights are what it is. Uh, love your channel. Thank you. And um you do good decoot wow deck profiles like your stuff all right that's it man uh, thank you 1k subs more eggman on this channel hey man yeah it is your fault get, get it together i like how you did the egg tilt uh slash like <laughs> the actual like we got like in the in the discord your actual own um which one call it uh uh emot emoticon is funny but it'd be funny if it showed up here anyway felix says uh more on top battle series yeah definitely High level gameplay. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know about that part, man. But I'm glad it does help you. Uh, Koopzilla says, um, "Thanks for the give video and giveaway. Don't mind seeing a video on the DBS uh, Dex podcast. I actually tried to get on that. Well, I don't say try to get on that, but he did offer. Um, if you're watching this, D uh, DBSX or uh, what is his name, Mark Hill, um, more than happy to be on that on that um, podcast at any time. So reach out to me. I'm more than happy." uh i don't know how to say your name more opening openings in maybe meta progressing yeah definitely that's that's gonna be one of the one of the things uh congrats thank you uh, more staple calls for new stats sets uh i might be doing this for world tournament but i don't know if there's gonna be any real staples we'll see uh more meta, meta re relevant decks for sure um yeah i needed 621 to guarantee a spot i know man don't worry there is no salt here um, your personal thoughts and breakdowns at current and past uh, tournaments, etc., etc. What you thought was going to be meta and what you used to spot uh, encounter and stuff like that. If I see you on untap untap, well, hey, hey, man, okay, we'll do that. Uh, I will put that to put to that put that to the side. Um, I, I'm trying to talk more about that. That's for sure. I like to talk more or see more budget deck profiles and more tips. And against the blue meta. Uh, there's a lot actually, man. If you play yellow, a lot of flying Nimbus is really good for it. Um, even uh like i said androids you know i i spoke about it already but yeah definitely i will i will be doing that it's just that i have to test it like i have to test deck profiles then i have to test against the meta and then i have to test um different things like fun deck profiles so it just takes time uh it's time for more dbs to content uh the gosh games like ori collection the the shonen jump one yeah definitely i want to check that out actually um i uh, like i'm seldom like once to two times a week want to do like different things other than dbs card game if you haven't been checking that out i have a lot of fun in that and i'm sure you will have too and if you are interested maybe that'll ga ga gauge some interest for you or gain some interest for you um so definitely check out fighters um xenoverse is going to be out pretty soon uh dbs or dbz dokkan battle legends all that other stuff and maybe even branching out to other ga gotcha games like this wouldn't be a bad idea it's just that i play so many gotcha games already so <laughs> yeah no was funny you uh fun meeting with my friend randy and everything star truck okay man don't even worry about it i i, I think i remember you um and uh maybe you show your thought process when building a deck there is a um i had i have to like for different videos like that that's very intensive uh i write out scripts and stuff so um the one that is building scripts or building a deck profile or just building a, a deck in general and how to play test it and what you think and what, everything else like that um is going to be soon if you ha if you need something or want something right now go check out uh cross worlds tcg he just came out with one pretty recently i believe um that explains deck profile building or deck deck building and everything else like that um so that's good and yeah definitely i agree off meta decks have been cool yeah i agree dodson uh congrats thank you more meta related okay more deck profiles okay thank you and uh fear crafting yeah i agree um that do exist uh in the in the day oh i yeah oh man pycon leader i don't know king kai leader would be really funny uh god support and everything else like that would be really really good there are a lot of archetypes and characters that haven't even touched yet gogeta is going to be one of them in set five i'm calling it right now because i think the, the starter deck is going to be that and I can't wait for him. Um, but I do want to do some stuff for create a card challenge uh, that's on, going on Reddit and the stuff that I have um, been brewing up as well. Different deck leaders. Yeah, I agree. Uh, not meta decks. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, no, I agree. I agree. No, no worries, man. 
um box tournaments yeah that's one that's coming out right now or out right now battle series yeah chuck i get it maybe we got some good games for my locals it's already bad enough people know that i have a youtube my locals i don't know if i'm going to be recording anything there <laughs> um uh grants of the 1k dark aether aether i can't even pronounce your name but yeah yeah man i remember you hey thank you for being part of uh the channel i really do appreciate that um uh, more openings and maybe one booster in each video declare a card hey maybe that'd be a good idea Thank you, Bomber. And uh, I don't know who this guy is. Who, <laughs> who cares? Budget deck profile, meta relevant, and then different price ranges under $50. $50. Yeah, I agree, my man. Um, thank you for all your support, Joel. I really do appreciate you. And no, you're not the winner. So that's it, guys. I just really wanted to go through. Like I said, it's all about returning to um, you guys and the community and subscribers. Uh, I really do appreciate everything. Um, there's more videos on the way, deck profiles, opening, budget stuff, other games. Uh, might even do a Slap, a slap City video. <laughs> I'm not kidding. This has been fun stuff. Um, and it's going to be a fun video. So I don't care if it gets like 10 views. It's, it's going to be fun. Anyway, uh, that's it. I will see you guys in the next one. Subscribe if you're new. I, if, you're already, if you're watching this, you're most likely subscribed already. Like, dislike, give me a comment. Um, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.